everybody, it's the 13th Wolfman. You know what? I finally, I'm making a video for what I picked up during the Severin sale back in June. At the end of June, Severin had a sale, uh, much like the Vinegar Syndrome sale of May. You know, they, they threw a bunch of stuff on, they threw a bunch of stuff on sale, dropped some prices, you know. I like the Severin stuff. I think it's just because some of it's, um, it, 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 Falls into two categories, stuff I've seen and stuff I want to see. You know, I mean, that's the best way to put it. I see a lot of stuff on there that I've seen, and I'm like, oh, I would like to have that movie. Then I see a lot of stuff on there going, oh, I would like to check that movie out. So I picked up some stuff. I picked up a total of six titles, and uh, only a few I've seen. Most of these are blind buys. So... Bear with me. Here we go. The first one, and this is a blind buy. Um, I remember when they released it last year, I was like, oh man, that's a title I want to see. And that is The Castle of Creeping Flesh. Just the title alone makes me want to see it. It's a Euro title, completely uncut. A haunted gothic tale of madness, lust, and blood-chilling horror. <laughs> you know. So, you got that. Next up is a Lucio Fulci film. And this is what I have seen. And I saw when I was younger. Want to see it again. And that is Enigma. Yeah. So, I got two Fulci films in here. And you know which ones they are. If This is the first one. Uh, yeah, Lucio Fulci, I like a lot of his stuff, and I've always liked the cover. I always thought that was, like, really cool. I used to have this poster when I was a kid. When I, I always say when I was a kid. When I was a teenager, back in the 80s, I had this poster. Next up is the other Fulci film, Demonia. Uh, I think I've seen this. This is one I think I've seen. I'm pretty sure I have. Um, I just don't remember it. I mean, I, I remember the, I remember the, the weird question mark symbol on the forehead. That's what I do remember. Um, I think I saw this on cable, like, when I was younger, and I don't think I saw the whole thing. I think it was, like, one of those things where you flip it through, and you're like, oh, like, oh, this seems interesting. I'll watch the rest of it someday, then you never see it again. So I pick up Demonia. Next is Revenge of the Living Dead Girls. This is complete blind buy. I've been trying to get this movie from Severin for a few years now. Every time I see it, it's on sale, it's sold out. I finally, finally got to this before this, they were out of stock this year. So, looking forward to that. Uh, it's just, uh, obviously a zombie film. So, Next up is The Attic Expeditions. I've seen this and... I didn't know that this was going to be one that they put out, but they did put it out and uh, had to grab it just because. It's got Seth Green. I mean, Andreas Jones, Seth Green, Jeffrey Combs, Ted Raimi. Ted Raimi, Sam Raimi's brother, the one that played Jockster the Mighty and Xena. Jeffrey Combs from Reanimator and many, 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 many other things. Seth Green, how can you go wrong? And then the one that I thought I picked up just be, I mean, again, this is, I've never seen this movie, but I love the title, um, so I had to get it just to, just to watch it to see what it's like, and that's Massacre in Dinosaur Valley. Yeah. This looks like a good time. I mean, uncut and remastered in 4K for the first time in America. At, it just looks, it the the cover itself just looks like really really odd, but yeah, I picked this just I just picked this up because I think I've seen it, but it the title sounds familiar, but I don't know if I've ever seen the movie. Let's put it that way. I know I've heard of it, I just don't know if I've ever seen it, and I love the title, Massacre in Dinosaur Valley. So those are the six movies I picked up at Severin during their during their version of uh, the Halfway to Black Friday sale, you know, the Severin sale. 
I love Severn movies. I I I think between Severn and Vinegar Syndrome, I have just a ton of stuff. I don't buy every title from every label. It's you know I I don't need to. There's stuff I'm just kind of like, eh. I wanted to get the Christopher Lee box set this year, but I just I just didn't. I didn't grab it this time. Maybe I get it during Black Friday. Who knows? It's kind of like what happens with Vinegar Syndrome. I wanted to get uh, the Homegrown Horror thing this year, but I didn't. I'm like, maybe I get it during Black Friday. If I don't, oh well. So be it. Of course, always like, subscribe, share, and comment. Always want to know what you have to say. When you do subscribe, hit that bell. That way you'll be notified anytime I put something new up. And it helps, you know, just, just the likes and the comments help get my stuff out there. So, please, do all of that. As always, I am the 13th Wolfman. And yes, I'm in the Doom Room, yet I'm on the prowl.